Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. It's a Sunday and we've decided to do a day trip to Oxford. So I think we're going to just explore the city, um, visit a museum, which may sound a bit boring, but I kind of love that sort of stuff. I've got last three to four weekends left of my GP rotation. So we're trying to make the most of it um, before I start my on calls, weekends and night shifts again on my obs and gynae rotation. So I thought I'd vlog today and take you guys along with me. Do you want to say something? Uh, I'm happy that I'm not driving. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm doing the drive, so you're doing the playlist. Yeah. Are you happy with that? I'm gonna be the DJ on the mix. All right, go on then. finally got to Oxford it took us an hour and a half to drive here then another half an hour to actually find parking parking is so annoying it's either permit holders and there's no like leeway as in it's 24 hours seven days a week or it's like double yellow line and you basically have to park in like car parks which were like four or five pound for like two three hours so anyways we parked up finally had lunch um, at this place called the handlebar yeah and this one's gassed because he just met like an old school football player what was his name so i am um, well. yeah uh so his name's uh, martin keone he used to play for arsenal he's an old school uh footballer legend i don't support arsenal but i you know i admire footballers like him you know old school tough yeah, so it was nice to meet him. He was quite friendly, he's a really um, nice guy actually. Basically, you saw him there, yeah. and I was like, are you sure, are you sure? And then you went up to him, and for like a few seconds, he was just looking at him a bit blankly, mm. and I was like, oh shit, like this ain't him, and this is so embarrassing. I was just like, mm. but it ended up being him, and he got a photo. Yeah, because I knew him, I'd like, well, I'd, I knew him when I saw him, and also I even like knew, definitely knew him because of his voice as well, because I'd see him, hear him on punditry as well, so mm. yeah. So it's nice to meet him, so yeah, he was that, quite friendly as well. Did that make your Sunday? I was gonna make my Sunday, but yeah, it was a good feeling. Now you know. You don't you don't there's not many footballers like that anymore, so so that's why it's good to meet him. What are we doing? Shopping, TK Maxx. <laughs> Literally it was meant to bring me to Oxford for a romantic Sunday so we can explore the city, look at the museums and walk around with a cup of coffee in our hand. And where do we come instead? To TK Maxx. If I need to exchange yes. something. It's not the time for that. Yeah, it is. I don't have a water bottle, I need it. I need it for work. Two hours later. No, it's only been five minutes. It's been two hours. It's five minutes. How long does it take to pick a water bottle? Five minutes. Two hours, it seems. All right, let's go. Found it. Yeah, it's been an idea. I'm a, a bit too big. Yeah, a bit. A bit too square. Yeah, so I'm, you like, you, I think round ones look better on you. Yeah. Don't be a rebel, look what it says. What does it say? Rebel. Yeah, thank you. Speed park. Oh, I'm going to report you. I'm going to do you right. <laughs> also, I didn't tell you guys what happened. Basically, Sadal went back to the car to get um, his jacket. And I was like sitting on, it was like a little plant area. Um, I was just sitting on there waiting for him. And I got approached by this like teenager on his bike asking me if I smoke weed because he wanted to sell me weed. And I was like, no. And then as he drove off, I was like, oh shit, I should have said like, I'm like an off-duty police officer. And he would have like shit his pants. But yeah, he'd gone off by then anyway. <laughs> I must look like a druggie today. Maybe that's why he had the guts to approach me. Anyways, trying to find the museum. Sadal's amazing map skills. Uh, doesn't look like we're near a museum at all. We're uh, three minutes away. Are you sure we're going the right way though? Yeah, we are going the right direction. Right. Straight ahead. We'll see in three minutes, guys. I'll update you in three minutes. It is comparison to me. 
look how big this is like our vertebrae is probably about this big compared to this and our spinal cord like canal is just about this big look at that jeez it's massive When this bird has better hair than you. Yeah, it's got more hair than I do. Imagine if you could still buy this. This is not my bag, this is your bag. It is your bag. I don't know what you're about. This is what married life does to you. What? You have to carry you one. You buy a Mickey Mouse bag. This is your bag. Yeah, guys, do you believe that? Not gonna lie, I thought this was a shower head, and then I remembered that we're in the science museum, and this is actually an old stethoscope. This is the, um, I think it's a famous light. I have a picture with this. I think we came here to visit Oxford Brookes University. That's how highly my secondary school thought of us, that they didn't actually bring us to see Oxford University. They brought us to see Oxford Brookes University, which is a sort of, it's another university in Oxford, but obviously it's not as prestigious as Oxford Uni. Um, but yeah, I remember this from then. I think I've got a picture. Should I try to find it and put it in? Yeah. Um, yeah, I think you have to pay to get in though, but I don't know if it's open to public today, but we'll see. Look how pretty the architecture is. Look. We just want to find like a cafe now where we could just sit outside and have a drink. Because it's really nice weather, it's like breezy but warm at the same time. It's like my fave weather. It's not stuffy, it's not higher than 22 degrees. But yeah. Should we check out inside first? Yeah. And then we can sit outside. Yeah. Although, I don't know if that's... Is that a grave? Well, it's inside of a church. So. It's a bit weird though. We're just walking to find somewhere to eat dinner. We think we found a burger place. Um, and just on the street that we're walking, there's like a massive crowd. And I was just saying to Sadao, imagine that's the queue for the place to get in. I don't think so. I think there's some sort of festival or something. But yeah, we're super tired because we've been walking around everywhere. We just parked the car up and that's been it. We've been walking ever since. So we're looking forward to just sitting down and eating now. We've just finished up with dinner, um, got back in the car and we're going to make our way back to London now. That Atomic Burger place was so nice, right? And the lady that was serving us was so cute as well. Um, it was like, the decor was just so funky and the food was really yummy. So if you're ever in Oxford, make sure you go to Atomic Burger. I think they have a branch in Bristol as well. Um, but yeah, they're really, really nice. So we're super tired right now. When we were at that place, we, you said there was a film called Bodyguard. Yeah. Who stars in it again? Whitney Houston. Oh yeah, Whitney Houston. Because um, they were playing old songs um, on the TV and the, her track came up and basically Sadal so was just telling me about the like the video, the, the music video was from the film that she played in. So I think we're going to go watch that um, when we go back home now. My feet are like killing me. Um, I think we've done like 16,000 steps today, so I think that's probably burnt off our fatty breakfast, brunch and fatty dinner as well. So yeah, hopefully anyway. We're just driving on the motorway and I think there's been some big accident because there's lots of fire engines and smoke. smoke. Just hope whoever it is is okay, it looks like quite bad. Yeah. It's always sad when that happens. Oh, it's a Mini Cooper on fire. Are you fixing yourself up? Oh, have you started recording? <laughs> yeah, so we're home. Um, we just got changed into our PJs, got into our comfortable place, which is our sofa in front of the TV. Um, we just got on, is it The Bodyguard or Bodyguard? 
think the, the film. Body, the, the, film. Body body. Huh? the Bodyguard from Whitney Houston. From 92. From 92. Yeah, so I was two years old when this film was made. So I'm going to watch that and then head to bed. If you've watched this far into the video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up um, and like the video. And you can follow me on my Instagram account as well, which is the junior doc. Unfortunately, the junior doctor has been taken by somebody else and they're not even active. Anyways, um, and don't forget to subscribe as well. All of that jazz. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Thank you.